Hi, I love you. Wow, hi. Thank you, thank you. <clears throat> this is new shit. New shit! This is a poem I've been working on for the better part of like two years. Um, and a, uh, uh, a, this is, uh, tonight's slam is a year after the memorial slam for Brett Bartlett, uh, which is when I had worked into my head to plan my tribute piece to her. So <clears throat> this is called The Force of 1G. 9.8 meters per second per second, also known as the force of Earth's gravity. The vast majority of creatures rarely think about the relationship with gravity, usually only reserved for the moments, however brief, that feel like falling in love with the floor. Sure, my body is sore, but I can't tell the difference anymore between bruises and useless pain. I'm saying I'm used to it. And I swear I'm not clumsy, I just have a sweet tooth, and the road looks like broken Oreo cookies. Four is my lucky number, 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 four seasons in a year, four years old when my father survived cancer, four times through physical therapy, my, my spine cracks four times every time I breathe. I can feel the weight of my skin on my spine, my skeleton in my hands. How am I supposed to stand up for myself when I can't stand up for more than two hours or sit down for more than two hours? My body is as restless as my mind, but also isn't strong enough to carry myself anywhere. An ant can lift 20 times its weight, but a human can only lift 1.5 times. I can only lift 0.5 times. But gravity is not why we experience diminishing returns on strength, it's oxygen sac saturation. At best, I'm out of breath, traveling through the breadth of my home, so I can only guess my body knows some mythic space I am meant to take up, my mind can't occupy, I am a giant. And a few years ago, I threw my back out, bending over to put on my pajamas. I went to the emergency room in my pajamas. What kind of life is it when going to bed becomes an emergency? What isn't an emergency? Overdoses of oses, your partner ices, your itises, ouchies. Make them sound smaller so that way at least they're picking on someone their own size. Tests clean, labs clean, arthritis panel clean, imaging clean. I'm in immaculate health like my body knows some mythic space I am meant to take up. My mind can't occupy. I break under the weight of waiting. But you're so young. Just wait until you're older. That isn't what you tell someone who's already constantly in pain, and some of us don't get to get older! And one way or the other, these meds can stop the pain. But I stay. I can feel and hear my bones move like the cracking of an ice shelf, deep and quaking. Thunder heard through solids alike to creaking wood in an ancient home. Hear the hinges and floorboards shift in the wind. But an abandoned building will stay standing for a hundred years before gravity takes it down. And until then, I can still shelter broken people and give them a place to rest. <laughs> 